Hi Water Signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those of you cross-watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. Today we're going to take a look at and see what is it that you need to hear right now at this particular point in time. So we'll try and see what messages Tarot would like to guide you on, or perhaps the universe is wanting to communicate with you. Guys, please just keep that in mind. It is going to be a general reading here, so um, just be mindful of that. If you are after a personalized tarot reading with myself, I do offer those. Please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video for you to get in contact with. Otherwise, let's go ahead and let's see what is it that you need to know at this particular point in time, okay? Hopefully something that might help you with your current situation or your current emotional state. Okay. Now, bottom of the deck, you have the Temperance card. Okay. Um, first and foremost, I just get this really strong message of there is a romantic energy, someone here around you. It feels like it's an existing energy. Okay. It feels like it's someone in, uh, someone that's circling around your energy and. The message I get with this person is this is someone who wants to get close to you guys, but their access to you is currently being restricted. That's the message that I get. So someone maybe wants to grow a lot more um, intimate and um, a lot more, uh, they want to grow you know, much more closer to you, but unfortunately their access to you is being restricted right now. So what does that mean? It could mean that this is an energy who is currently in a relationship with someone else, okay? They may be married or they may be engaged or they may be like in a union in a relationship with someone. However, it feels like this is someone who's trying to manifest you. There's a very strong desire to want to grow and get closer to you. But unfortunately, um, their access to you is being restricted. So if you feel, if you know who I'm talking about here. And if you don't know how this person feels. I think it's important for you to know that this is someone who is very drawn to you this is someone who's very attracted to you but unfortunately they feel like their access to you is restricted here so i feel like that's something some of you needed to know all in good time okay i don't know what it means but the message that i have is that something he is going to unfold all in good time now with the magician's energy as well you currently have this desire as well as this energy and this commitment here to pursue anything that you want or anything that you desire okay it's a very powerful energy and you should really take advantage of that so if you're wanting to attract a certain person a certain relationship a certain partner a certain dream a job a goal career whatever whomever it is that you're wanting to attract and bring into your life you've got such a powerful energy 
field around you, okay? You've got desire and commitment here to attract, you know, attract the person or attract the situation here. So do take advantage of that because you have this power of desire behind you here. You're... Remember that you are powerful here. Sometimes I think you forget, and maybe that's why you joined me here for this reading, is that you need to be reminded you are powerful. Our thoughts are constantly creating your reality. Okay, it what it, it's the same to be true with your positive as well as your negative thoughts. So um, you know, the magician is a reminder that because he connects the forces between heaven and between earth, and he understands the meaning behind the words as above so below so you need to remind yourself if you've forgotten that the mind our mind and our world are only reflections of one another okay so start creating your inner world and your outer world will follow okay so start from the inside and your outer world is going to mold itself here it's also time to tap into your full potential. Stop hesitating. Whatever it is that you're doing here, some of you are hesitating. You need to stop with the hesitation. It's now time to tap into your full potential. And it, whether it's like in your new job, in your new relationship, in your, your new partnership, it's now to take, it's now time to take action and stop holding yourself back. Because you're not only holding yourself back from an opportunity or from pursuing a current partner you're also holding yourself back from being the you know from becoming the best version of yourself here so stop doing that if you are doing that guys certain choices are going to have to be made for you here and it feels like some of these choices are going to bring great change for you is what i get um Make sure there's no deception or illusions here. Some of you, I feel like, and it could be you, okay? It doesn't necessarily mean that you have a deceitful energy around you, but I feel like with your current situation, whether it's romance, business, or um, it could be any, your, you know, it could relate to any uh, current situation right now. Some of you are being disillusioned about something. It could be that you're potentially disillusioning yourself to believe something that isn't real, but I feel like you need to make sure that there are no illusions here about a certain individual, about a certain situation here. With the Eight of Pentacles as well, uh, concentrate here. I feel like some of you really need to sharpen your focus here, okay, because your energy has been a little bit scattered. You have that potential and you have the skills and the talents that you need. Stop looking outside, okay? Everything that you possess is within within you. All you need to do is sharpen that focus here and, you know, much like the uh, figure in the picture here with each coin that he's creating here his skills are improving and he's becoming more and more masterful so whatever it is some of you have been wanting to pick up a hobby learn something new um, you know for those of you creatives and writers out there keep like keep stretching that writing muscle keep working and you're going to become um you know a master or a genius at it but if you don't do it you will not get there so you need to work hard to become a master at something okay there's no shortcut guys sorry to burst your bubble here there's no shortcut to becoming a creative genius or a master or an artist here you're going to have to put in the work there's no shortcut as well to creating that i you know that perfect or idyllic relationship as well now i love the full card for you here beautiful energy with the full card here it's a reminder for um, a lot of you that you are on the outset of your journey you're standing on the cliff's edge on the precipice here all you have to do is take a leap of faith here okay some of you you're worrying too much you're in your head too much you need to get out of your head here um you know much like the fool's energy look at him he's about to skip off this precipice into the unknown and he seems seemingly unaware something wonderful is happening for you here but you need to embrace it guys okay you don't need to some of you you need to realize that you don't need to have it all figured out okay you don't need you don't need a plan i feel like 
all the fool the fool is excited to start his expedition okay and that's all he's focused on okay he's not he's not concerning himself with the journey that lies ahead uh, all you have to do is take your first step even if it is into the unknown so if you're um, you are being called here to commit to yourself and follow your heart and take that leap of faith here and now is a time that you have to trust yourself there's no point in other people trusting around you know everyone else you know putting their trust or their faith in you if you can't trust yourself so as you undertake some sort of new journey whether it's a new relationship a new romance a new cycle a new chapter a new you whatever it is uh, throw caution to the wind but be ready to embrace the unknown because and much like the fool have an open curious mind and also a sense of excitement here Leave behind any worry, fear, or anxiety here about what may or may not happen. Okay, let the universe here, you know, work its magic. It's time to embrace new skills, new growth, new opportunities here. Now, nine of wands, you need to stand strong here. And you need to, you need to remain resilient. There's a test of faith that's happening in your life right now. You're being tested here. I don't know if there is, if the universe is testing you, if your current partner or your girlfriend or boyfriend is testing you, if your friend, I don't know who this person is, but you're, I, I get the message that there's a, this is a test of faith here. So stand strong. Um, you could be on the edge of exhaustion here, but I feel like you're almost at the finish line. Um with something here three of cups you might not see it now but you are going to be very very happy here in the very near future you're going to be extremely happy uh, so much so that th there's this sense of joy and wonder and there's this celebration of all the goodness in your life here so especially for those of you that you know there's someone here who's about to enter your life or maybe this person is already in in your life this is all manifesting okay now some of this is happening behind the scenes so you might not actually have any real physical tangible evidence to to support okay to support that this is happening and this is manifesting for you but you need to keep the faith you need to keep the faith keeping you know trusting in something or someone even if you don't see it that's what faith is okay you don't see it and then you believe it you believe it and then you see it so there is something wonderful here manifesting for you especially in regards to love an engagement a marriage a wonderful beautiful soul that's coming into your life a soulmate a destiny here uh, there's a, a calling Okay, there's something absolutely wonderful and beautiful that you're attracting into your life here. And the energy feels really high and the two of you are going to do amazing things together. But you just need to trust, trust in yourself more and trust in the universe because it does have your back. And, you know, you are essentially, I feel like you're manifesting someone here and someone is manifesting you. But be patient, guys, all in good time, all in good time. All right, and these are your messages. Thanks so much for watching and listening. Please share your support by liking, sharing, subscribing to the channel. For those of you interested in a personal reading, feel free to reach out. Bye for now.